Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We're back at the Vin Diesel build. Did a few things differently, so this week I decided to do a list for the entire week. And by the end of this week, it should be looking pretty close to done. Let's, uh, let's walk you through it. So today is Wednesday, and I just got the last coat of the sealer on the shower saw for the cedar. All I should have to do is let that dry today, go in and silicone it tomorrow, and it should be, stall should be, should be done. Two other things we're doing today, but I didn't, I didn't want to like show you guys me sealing that shower for like the millionth time. So you guys pretty much got a gist of that. We're going to mount the propane tank under the, under the cabinet today. And we are going to hang the cabinet doors, which you guys seen me finish in the last video. And that's going to be it for today. I decided to try and just set small goals to make progress than do big goals and be overwhelmed. So that's it for today. We'll see how we feel at the end of all those missions and then maybe we'll go forward or not. Tomorrow, we are going to do the drawer above the fridge, which drawers suck. Um, we're gonna do the drawer under the stove, two drawers. Drawers are such a pain in the butt that I'm given a lot of time for those. Friday, literally, is just slide out pantry. That's it. Slide out pantries are a pain in the butt. So all of Friday is for the slide out pantry. And then Saturday, we're going to see if we can get the solar on the roof. Exciting stuff. And like, that should pretty much be it. Like once the cabinets and stuff are all done. So let's get into the work day today and see what we can get. Remember when we thought we were done with this, uh, with the plumbing here? We're not. <laughs> so, Good Times Homestead. Maybe you can see that. Uh, they said, hey, might check your safety pop-off valve you reinstalled. Looks like it's backwards. The white bar has to be in the water to release by temp and pressure. The way you installed it, it won't be able to open up when over pressure. Just a heads up. Good Times Homestead is right. If you see the arrow of the water, it's going backwards. It needs to be this way. So I thought I was done with this plumbing. I have to take all this apart again. I put this in wrong. I don't know how many times I've done the plumbing in this bus. At least I'll know how to do it in the next one. So I had a small mission today and I was just going to deal with this later, but now I think I'm just going to handle it now and keep pushing forward. So let's deal with it again. a ton of food but it's like you don't need more than that we as americans just typically overeat i noticed in my last vlog i leave you guys hanging on a lot of stuff like the water what happened nobody knows they were asking the lean cuisine the review wasn't bad i couldn't have cooked that so i'm gonna try and figure out a way to cook these without a microwave in the bus when we get back to bus life and huh
All right. I think the plumbing is fixed again. <laughs> Shout out to the guy who told me that I had the thing in wrong. I had to go in and redo the whole deal. But now that it's already done, I can move on with my missions for the day. So I'm going to clean up all this stuff right here and then we're going to mount the propane tank. I accomplished all my missions today and it's only three o'clock. So I'm gonna clean up, see how much time's left after I'm done cleaning up, and then maybe I'll start working on tomorrow's stuff. So let's clean up and then we'll figure it out. Good morning. It's a new day. It's a big day. Any of y'all ever done drawers in one of these bills before or side out pantries? If you have, you know that they suck. So I've been putting off the drawers for one reason or another because they suck for a long time. But today, we got the cabinets on yesterday and today I would love to get all these sliders put up there and get all the drawers cut and painted and like hopefully installed that would be awesome that's kind of the mission for today it's kind of a big one so i'm going to try and be off my phone and just stay focused on the game but like once those cabinets are all in that's pretty much been diesel pretty much done then it's just finishing touches kind of kind of a big day so if i can accomplish what i hope to accomplish today it should be awesome I got this Craig drawer slide jig. I'm hoping it'll help make drawers not suck so much. So, we'll see. <laughs> All right. So how are we supposed to use these?
just messed up. <laughs> so I wrote 15 as the dimension on my cut list. So I made this 15 inches wide, but the gap is actually 15 and three quarter. So I just spent, I just spent all this time making that drawer and it's the wrong size. So I'm gonna take a break and do lunch. Hello. All right, so we're not building today. We are headed over to Bend because Breed Love Guitars has been trying to get me to switch out my little companion guitar for like months. I just want something a little bigger so that has a little more body to the sound and they've had one sitting in their office for a long time waiting for me. I just haven't made the time to go over there and get it. So. I told Brittany, my contact at Breed Love Guitars, that I would come over there this week. And I had every intention of doing so. I thought I would finish some other projects. But here we are, Friday. So I have a feeling if I told her I'll come next week again, she won't believe me. So I'm taking Friday. Jaylena and I are headed off to Bend to go switch this guitar out. And you know, I guess we'll kind of bop around too. This is our, this is our day off. So this is Sunday. We're gonna go up to Woodburn, go to the outlet malls, get some food. Maybe. Date day. Date day. We're not gonna film any of it. 
So we'll pick this vlog up after we get back. So I'll see you then. See you then. We're back in the shop bay. I haven't filmed, so Jaylena and I went on a errand slash date day on Sunday. And yesterday I spent all day making a time lapse video of Schooliana. And today I'm hoping I can finish the cabinetry. All I gotta do is finish cutting the pull out pantry, and then I gotta cut some drawer faces and like and get paint and oil on them and i'm thinking i can get that done today so that's our mission and let's get into it You guys remember me saying I don't like slide out pantries well here we go for some reason this is not not working so it's hitting something Alright, let me explain what I did. I was getting a little worried that I was going to have to take this whole thing down and cut it. Basically, I had a slider on this side and a slider on that side and it was twisting for some reason. So, I was like, I wonder if I could just put two sliders on one side. And that's what I did. And now it's like super straight. So maybe that's how to do these. I hung one and then basically hung this with it in there and that sucker goes in nice. Lines up straight, pulls out straight. Maybe that's the way to do a slide out pantry. I was thinking I was screwed but it's looking good.
of the work day and I got all the drawers uh, cut I got them sealed got them put back in there and then I got all the faces over here I got them cut and painted I, I wanted to get everything that needed a dry time done tonight because it's so cold it's hard for anything to dry so that gives all this enough time to dry overnight and then uh, I could put it all together tomorrow. So the cabinets should be done tomorrow. The faces should be put on, the drawer poles should be on, and then I just gotta cut some little rubber stuff to put in there and like the cabinetry is done. Stoked. It's a new day. The faces for the drawers are dry. The drawers in the bus are dry and we're gonna put it all together and finish the cabinetry. I'm excited to see that done. Let's get into it. Diesel build that is gonna be the end of this video I'm stoked it was a long time coming and then the vision I had in my head is real it's all there it's all in there and uh, man now we're just doing a couple finishing touches repainting some stuff and this one's done it's exciting oh I gotta put solar on the roof too but that's not that hard so cabinetry is done I forgot what I'm supposed to say, if you like bus building, schoolies, or anything to do with that kind of stuff, you should like, subscribe if you're not already, and hang out on this channel, because everything on this channel is bus life related. We'll see you in the next video.